for, of course, here is some type of activity base that's going to be related, a cost driver driving the cost that we have, some type of activity base that we can uh, quantify in some way and then compare departments so that we can have a ratio analysis comparing the relative use of the activity base from department to, to department compared to the total resulting in ratios or percentages that add up to 100 which we can then apply out the costs based on so again once you know this concept then you can apply it and you know the activity base then you can apply it to whatever activity base uh, is being used as we allocate the indirect expenses out recall that the service departments are going to be something that we allocate indirect expenses to as well and then we're going to take the total of those service departments and we're going to use them to allocate to the revenue generating departments as well so something like the maintenance we're going to say okay anything that needs to be applied to the maintenance that's indirect that should be applied to the maintenance department we will apply to the maintenance department once the maintenance department has been completed we know the cost of it we're going to take that total cost for the maintenance department and apply it to uh, the rest of the department's revenue generation uh, departments uh, to complete the process we'll use a similar basis in order to do that or a similar process to do that we'll determine an activity base we'll use that ratio process to apply out the entire service department to the relevant uh, departments to apply them out to with the similar or same ratio analysis choosing an activity base that would be appropriate for that allocation.